What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to Civilization Five as Venice. We're doing oh, another barbarian cat. Uh, it's been a while since I last played. It's I had a break over Christmas. I had some videos made, but we're back now. And uh, yes, yeah, Songhai, you can have open borders. I was going to say like, oh, everything's going well, and then this barbarian camp just reminded me of its existence and just killed one of my units. That's not what I wanted. Uh, and I. Um. Okay, well let's get deal with that encampment. It's going to be a bit awkward <laughs> not having a bowman, but either way, people have recommended I buy the land schneck. Oh, we're about to get the Sistine Chapel. Nice. Um, I buy these land schnecks. I'm going to buy a couple now, just so I don't forget. Uh, there we go. <laughs> nice. And they can actually move this turn, so I actually send him over here. And you go protect this trade. I'm going to use them to sort of protect trade and stuff like that. So that's a useful option we now have. Obviously, barbarians are the big issue here, because we should be using all 10 of our trade routes. The map means we probably can't get to 10. Plus 25% culture in Oh, I didn't check what it was before. That's nice. Two slots for great works of art. I mean, that's not that's not super, but it was available to us. We got it. Let's not complain. <laughs> uh, oh, I thought I was being smart, but the forest, the forest was too strong. <laughs> okay, I want to get that worker back. That is not a good spot to lose a worker. Yeah, come protect this trade over here. But yeah, the sea obviously prevents us from getting those trade routes. I'm not sure if this city... People have said grab this city. I, obviously, we haven't explored up here. I need to do that to see if we can make it worthwhile. I think I should probably... Opera House. Um, all of these things I can get in my own time. Obviously, they have bonuses to getting them straight away. So we may as well build the ironworks now. In particular. 15 population. I was moaning at the start. It was slow growing. That, that's not too bad now. It's like joint biggest. Actually, uh, it's, it's up there. <laughs> okay, let's get off. I can upgrade my bowman. I will do that soon. Oh, another encampment. Nice. I guess more XP at the very least. There we go. That's that one dealt with. And uh, I may as well send this pikeman over. I don't have any bowmen up here, which sucks. No ranged units. But the land neck should be okay. These guys are pretty low. Ivory. Yeah, you can have that. Not been doing the best deals. I might need to look into that a bit more. See, as you guys know, my play style. <laughs> I like how I describe it as my play style and not I suck at this game sometimes. Oh, they just had... There must be... I don't know who's attacking them. Someone else is obviously attacking them too. Um, there you go. Physics, steel. Uh, we could go physics. Trebuchets. Long swordsman. That's not it. Banking would be nice. Forbidden palace requires patronage. I don't think we went patronage. That's the religious one, right? So I don't think so. Leaning Tower of Pisa. Plus 25% generation of great people. I would really like that. So we need print physics to get... Okay, we might be too late to get that. But who knows? Never count ourselves out. Looks like there's another barbarian encampment. Yep, another one up this way. So we'll go deal with that. I think it's, it might be that one all the way up there. But either way, we may as well deal with them. They seem to be our biggest issue at the moment. More so than the other sieves. Did that scout survive, by the way? I, I built one. No, it died. Yeah, I thought so. It did die. That's a shame. Oh, that stupid pikeman moved right back to where at least... Oh, it's that crossbowman that's helping. Thank you. Oop. Oh, that was dumb. Sorry. <laughs> Didn't mean to do that. Catapult. Come over here. Rather not have to fix everything again. But I'd like my workers to be able to walk around and do what they want. Again. That was a nice time back then. Back in the good old days. Yeah, I didn't think they'd be able to reach. Okay, get up on that hill. Uh, our work here is done, pretty much, I think. I mean, that's me being over... Oh, so close. If we lose that unit, I'm annoyed now. Plus 25% great people generation again. Uh, yes, let's grab that. Let's just get build these wonders as quick as we can. Sneak in to trap them. Oh. Okay, worker, build a mine. I do need to upgrade my bowman. I want to do that before I forget. <clears throat> so I'll do it this turn. Don't know if we have enough money to do all of them, actually. Hopefully, though, we will. Boom, boom. Oh, you're not in my borders. Okay, let's get this horseman. It's done more than enough damage now. There we go. Dealt with. Oh, they had to spawn an archer. <laughs> soon, as soon as I was close... To taking it, they're just like, nope, that's not happening, and I'm out of money. Okay, right, we need that. 
If we can clear three encampments in quick succession, that's going to be good for XP. Money, I guess, as well. And just make the area a whole lot, whole lot less barbarian infest. Oh, seriously? Why? Where are these ones coming from? <laughs> just coming from everywhere. It's annoying. Oh, the camp's wide open. There we go. Dealt with them. Let's head this way. I don't think the catapult actually needs to go. <laughs> Oh, oh, all right, let's upgrade you before I forget. There we go. Let's start sending stuff. About to get the National Epic, too. Just keep improving Venice. Try and get as many great people as possible. We still haven't got another great merchant. I don't know exactly the conditions, but I'm trying. <laughs> Giving it my everything. Doesn't seem to be working just yet. Okay, these units are a bit far away. Uh, crossbowman. Where on earth did that barbarian go? I have no idea. I have so much trade now options but like that we know that route's pretty dangerous we just cleared this way okay we did go Mogadishu before that's probably the safest one Lahas is pretty safe too if I build another caravan now uh, yeah let's build the caravan first let's try and get some more I mean we're making 32 gold per turn which isn't bad <laughs> considering we have two caravans but out of 10, I wish we should make the most. I don't know what the limit is, but for obviously everyone else assumes around 5. Okay, we're doing pretty badly. But we're good on science, so I'll take that. Take that as a victory. Just going to go deal with every barbarian encampment I can find. Uh, Mogadishu again, yep. Getting another car caravan coming through. Come and heal. Research. I wanted to go for the printing press, see if we can get the Tower of Pisa. Probably won't, but it's worth the try. Why not? Why not go for it? 11 turns, that's kind of a long time. And since someone had Notre Dame a while ago, maybe we won't get it. But it, it's worth a worth a look. Lahasa. Uh, if we can go to Lahasa from there, that's good. And then I'll build another one to send to Lahasa from Tyre. It's now one turn to build them, not two. Nice. Even better. I don't know why the catapult is going first. That is definitely not a great idea. And I hope no one declares war on me. I'm just going to have to hedge my bets that no one does. Because we will die if someone does. While I'm away dealing with these barbarians. Not I have the biggest military in the world. Uh, eighth out of twelve. Which isn't great. The Aztecs as well. Who are like one of our nearest neighbours. Have the biggest. That's good to know. Ah, uh, there is the encampment that is bothering us. I don't think it's the one up north. I mean, I can't imagine they're helping out, but I'm sure they are playing their part too. At least now they're mainly gone, I can automate the workers again. It's always a start. Opera House, Musicians Guild, Opera House, uh, we'll build another caravan. <laughs> start getting them going out of Tyre again. Uh, we're dealing with more and more of the barbarians. We can finally do some useful stuff, increase our income. It's going to be a nice... Oh, so they just had to, didn't they? That was so that was so so obviously about to happen. <laughs> Love that. We've been very brave with that catapult and now it's gonna run away. Uh, Vancouver. I think that way is safe now. We can only hope. Okay, you can still kill them. That you were very good at killing them. Jeez. Wasn't expecting it to just waltz on in there, but warriors are pretty old and it was like half health. That makes sense, I guess. Please don't die, catapult. I don't know why I was doing that. I was just taking my chances. It, it, it's safe. It's not the end of the world yet. No more trade routes here. Send you over. Oh, you get a nice upgrade. Excellent. I don't know if they'll be able to kill the swordsman in the same fashion, so I'm just gonna... Uh, what's it saying? Minor victory? Okay. Well, we're not gonna loot. We're not gonna die, so that's alright. Let's quickly grab a musician's guild now. The catapult actually got an upgrade. See, I knew what I was doing. It's now it's not really protected. The archers are going to show up here now, but the pikeman is now here to give it a bit of a better defense. In fact, I'll send the pikeman through. Oh, natural wonder! There we go. See, finding things all the time. There we go. In we go. Don't have to worry about the boat for now. We'll, we'll leave that to the other sieves to deal with. There we go. More money. Let's go deal with that final barbarian camp. Because they've been, there's another one over there, but that, that's Greece's problem. That's not going to interfere with our trade, hopefully. So we'll leave that. We're up to half our trade routes. Um, I think we can only have eight maximum if I build all of them anyway, because of how because of range. 
So there might be another encampment out this sort of this direction as well, because of where that archer is. Uh, you just come stand there, protect me. Good. One more turn. Oh, uh, oh sorry, Byzantium. Like I don't have a problem with you. It's just your bottom by the looks of things. <laughs> Actually, Carthage is definitely doing worse. I don't know why they're not last, basically. Oh, that was easy. Archers are obviously pretty weak now. Good to know. I thought I told you to stay there. Okay, and let's keep sending this stuff up to go clear that fire. It's really recommending the Great Galates. I have no idea why. Does it not understand? They are pretty much completely useless to us in this small sea that we can't escape. <laughs> I'm really hoping there's like a hidden city state up here on this peninsula. I'm actually going to go and check it just to be sure. These units can sort of fan out and push up into this peninsula, deal with the final barbarians. Of course, killing these ones will stop all the boats that are... They're annoying. They're not They're not an issue because there's no cargo ships for me. But, you know, it would help to get rid of them. It's just less annoying. And again, change home city. These are the more risky routes, the ones to Babylon. So we've got to be a little bit more picky with where they go. Because there is barbarians down there. Uh, opera house, yes. Because, yeah, that, there's I think there's this encampment here is causing problems. But if I send them to this city, we might be alright. Actually, if I send them straight... Oh, there's one there now. Um, I might just save it. I don't know. There's nowhere else I can go. Uh, caravan, Carthage, Akkad. Akkad is pretty poor. This one's probably the best one, just because it's straight through the city state. It's probably the safest out of those, but I'm not going to do the other two. They would be pretty, pretty bad options at this point in time. There we go, research. Let's go banking. And that's going to be it for this episode. So as always, if you have enjoyed, be sure to leave a like and a comment down below. And be sure to subscribe as well if you're new to the channel. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.